Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. So in today's video, we're covering a step-by-step -step guide on how to download and install Windows Server 2022. Now, before we get into that, if you're interested in your own copy of Windows Server 2022 or other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll have links in the description box below. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so the first thing that we need to do to get started with this process is sign up for the Windows Insider program. All right, so we're gonna start on this page here. We'll leave a link for this page in the description box below. And once we're here, we want the ISO downloads. So we're gonna click on download the ISO. Now to the right, we can register for our free trial. And we just have to fill out some basic information and we'll press download now. Now we're gonna click on the ISO downloads 64-bit edition and we're gonna let this download. We'll see you guys once it's finished. All right, so once the ISO is downloaded, we're gonna to click to go ahead and open the file. Just pull it up for my downloads actually. So we'll double click on the ISO. All right, and then once we're inside the ISO file, we're simply just gonna run the setup. So we'll double click to open and we'll select yes for that. And now we have entered the Windows Server setup wizard. So we're gonna click next. And here we can pick our edition of Windows Server. I'm gonna go ahead and stay with the standard evaluation and I'll press next. Here we'll press accept and I'm starting a new installation so I'm gonna keep this at nothing and I'll press next. Here we'll press yes. Now it's gonna run an update check. All right, so it's finished running the update check. If everything looks good, which mine does, we're gonna press install. Now we're gonna let this run and we'll see you guys once it's complete. All right, so Windows Server has just finished installing. Here it wants us to change the password before we sign in, so we'll press OK. We're gonna enter our password. All right, and we just hit apply after changing the password. And now we're in our PowerShell command line to manage our Windows 2022 server. If we wanted the desktop experience, we simply would have just gone with the data center version. In the next video that we're gonna make, we're gonna cover configuration for Windows Server. All right, so that's gonna do it for today's video. Again, stay tuned for the configuration of Windows Server. We're gonna make a video for that next. If you guys have any questions, drop them in the comment section below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Again, if you're interested in purchasing your own copy of Windows Server or other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll have the links in the description box below. So thanks for watching and we'll see you guys in the next video.